Hi, I'm Rokaj, your digital lifestyle expert. And I'm going to show you how to repair some of the scratches if they get onto your DVDs. Nothing is more frustrating. You're watching your favorite movie or show that you've dubbed over to DVD and it's freezing. Or it says disc error on the machine and it goes. Or skipping over bad area and disc. It kills me. You think you may never be able to get it again, but you can. Take a deep breath and I'm going to give you some pointers on how to take care of it. It's real simple. First. You may consider, if you've got a lot of DVDs and CDs like most people, is to go and invest in a professional CD or DVD cleaning machine, okay? And what that'll consist of is it'll clean and then it'll repair if it doesn't work. And it's a little thing that almost looks like a little portable CD player. And you put it in there um, and you'll notice it'll have some little pads in there, usually two sets of pads, a buffing pad and a cleaning pad. And then you'll put the, um, you'll put the juice around the buffing pad and then you'll put it in, you push play and it'll look like it's playing the disc, except it'll make a grinding noise and it'll sound like it's eating it, but that's cool. It's all right. When it comes out, you can test it. If the cleaning isn't enough, then you put it back in and then it actually will try to go repair. You can also get a cheaper version. It'll run about $20 or $30 where you can get the liquid that goes in there because what happens is, is that you've got this scratch. Scratch is very analogous to the scratch on a, on a phono record. All right, The laser needs to read in a spiral out and there's a scratch in front of it. The laser doesn't know where to go. It refracts the light. Well, you can get a little bit of that goop and sort of put it on and using a, a cloth that they provide or either a lintless cloth, moving it through and kind of filling in the scratches. And that's kind of like dragging your finger in the dirt and then just sort of filling it in again, trying to create that groove. Again, cleaning is always a good first step, a good way to clean. Again, lint-free rag, and you want to always push away. You never want to do little circles. Again, you could create you could create secondary scratching in there and looping is not very good. Get it nice and clean there. If not, there do have some uh, uh, professional services out on the web that use that use um, uh, that you can send the disc out and they'll do some professional repairing to the disc. Some local places have that outbound service. You'll pay a couple of bucks for it, more than replacing the movie, but if it's your precious memories, your wedding disc, that's something you want to invest in. Like me, Rokaz, your digital lifestyle expert, saying, stream you later.